It is nature's most fascinating, hypnotic, exotic plant. The orchid, the queen of all flowers, with an endlessly alluring variety of blooms. It's the focus of the annual orchid mania at the Cleveland Botanical Garden. We have a thousand or more varieties of orchids just inside the garden, in the glass house, in this little conservatory, everywhere you look. Purple rain is the theme of this year's show. Cynthia Druckenbrod says it's a wink and a nod to the orchid's regal history and a display fit for a prince, a psychedelic array of color and scents. Most of these are super sweet. Some of them are peppery. Some of them are citrusy. Some of them don't smell so great, but they have a fragrance nevertheless. You have one that doesn't smell so great. What is that? There's one, one called Doggy Dew, <laughs> and it's in the glass house, and that one smells just like it sounds. <laughs> Sherry Baby, Wildcat Bobcat, Trick or Treat, even Pinocchio. Many varieties were named with a sense of humor, but whatever they're called, they're the ultimate floral fantasy. The exotic orchid has been revered throughout history. In fact, it is the oldest flower on earth, going back to the time of the dinosaurs. Orchid mania will transport you to a place far from the snow and ice, a place of waterfalls, tropical greenery, and dreamlike flowers. Let your senses take over. Please sniff, please touch, please look, please enjoy. Thank you. Wonderful. You are Thank such you. a great interview. Thank oh my you. Gosh. It's fun. It's fun. I want people it's to fun. enjoy these. Isn't that pretty? Mm -hmm. Those are cymbidiums, and they make a. There's a fragrance um, 